Well, I happened to get this out the door from CMHIP, um, as it is my document. And this is the document that determines that you're competent to proceed in a criminal court case. Now, look at this. This is hideous. Whenever do you have your liberties taken because of learning how to wipe your ass, brush your hair, brush your teeth, put on your clothes, make your bed... Look at this. This means you're competent. Hello, people. Have you seen my uh, level of education? Hello, people. Have you seen my work ethic? Have you seen my daily tasks? Come on. This is completely hideous. This is real stuff, you guys. This is unbelievable. Nobody can actually believe this because it hasn't happened to them. If it's happened to you, then you know exactly what I'm talking about. This is competency. They kidnap you for the law. Nowhere in the Constitution or the color of law does it say that the state can actually kidnap you because they want to treat you for schizophrenia, bipolar, um, schizoid disorders, all kinds of stuff. They can't unless you are a danger to self or others. You could be bat fucking crazy as long as you can sit in a courtroom and you can be quiet and you can listen and rationalize and understand what's going on, you're competent. It doesn't matter. They, they can't do shit. In America, First Amendment right, you could be schizophrenic all you want. And no, I'm not schizophrenic. I'm using that as an example. But you, you don't have to take the medications. You don't have to do anything unless you are a danger to self or others. And there are clear, distinct definitions and criteria that must be met to determine whether you're dangerous. Just because you hand somebody a pen, CMHIP, does not mean you're dangerous. Yeah, that really happened. This uh, poor poor woman at uh, CMHIP handed a nurse a pen after the nurse hung up on her on the phone when she was on with her attorney, and she didn't want her to uh, talk to her attorney. And they did an illegal blood draw because she said no, she did not want their blood, so the lady said they were going to strap her down to get her blood. Well, so she handed them a pen, and then they said she was dangerous. You guys would be actually baffled what's going on. It is mind-blowing. It makes no sense. It is extremely illegal. There's video cameras. You can tap them. The uh, Free State of Colorado laws govern that we can regulate the people and the government, which means you can tap those cameras. And it's legal in Colorado. You have to look at here. Um, your digestive group, are your bowels working? They give you so much medication that your bowels quit working. Now how, how great is that? Yeah, every day they care if you take a poop. But yet they don't care about if you're paying your bills. They don't give a crap. They take your phone. They take your abilities to pay your mortgages, pay your bills. In fact, they didn't even let me pay my taxes. They didn't even let me um, call out to my friends to make sure that all my other bills were paid. They caused such a horrific hardship on me, and they don't care. And that's what they employ for. That's their intention. Because this is one way, CMHIP, if you look at the books, is one way the government and the state can take all of your estate. Take your government checks. Take everything from you. It's sick.